everyone, me again. Welcome back to X Amelia X. And if you are new, hello to you too. My name is Amelia. We do all kinds of videos on this channel everything from beauty tutorials to fashion to travel and we weekly vlog every Tuesday at 7. So if you like my face, if you like what you see, click the subscribe button. Stick around for a while. So today we are going to be doing a video that I've promised for a while and it's the ASOS Fuller Bust Haul slash Review. Now I'm currently rocking a size 34F. Bazooma, and I absolutely love them but I do find it difficult to buy certain items of clothing that actually look good or actually fit properly on a fuller bust. Mostly shirts, cami tops and swimwear that I struggle to find to fit the girls. So I had a look online the other day and I found out that ASOS having a whole range of clothes fit for ladies with larger busts which is amazing. So I bought some of the stuff and I'm going to try them on today and I'm going to see how well they fit and if they're worth buying. And just a little disclosure before we carry on, yes, I do sound like a man. I've just got over the world's worst cold. It's been horrible. So please send love because we are powering through. Personally, I think it's sexy, but then again, I have been single for quite a while. I'm going to put out the same disclosure that I put with my summer curvy lookbook and that is the fact that curvy is not a dirty word. Curvy should not have any negative connotations attached to it. It is a beautiful word to describe a woman or a guy with curve to their body. You can be slim and curvy, you can be plus size and curvy, it just means that maybe you've got a fuller bust, some wide hips, a nice big bum or some strong thighs. Own your curves ladies, love them like I do. It's a wonderful place to be. Enjoy. So we're going to try on a few different bits from the ASOS Fuller Bus range um, and I'm going to be wearing the same bra throughout this haul. For those of you wondering, I have talked about this bra so many times, I love it, I should be getting paid by them, Wonder Bra, call me. But it's the best bra you will ever buy, it is the Wonder Bra Strapless Thingy My Bobby, I don't know its exact name, I'll leave a link down below so you can buy it. It's a little bit pricey, it's like 35 to 40 quid, but it is fantastically supportive, it's got no straps so you can wear it with anything, it gives you a beautiful shape and I just absolutely love it, it's super comfortable, definitely invest in a good bra and your bazoomers will thank you. Okay, let's start with the staple item that I struggle the most to find with a fuller bust and that is a plain white shirt. Now, I picked up this one, it's actually from their tall range, I'm 5 foot 6, 5 foot 7, which I know isn't super tall, but I like to have shirts and tops that are of a decent length, so another little top tip for you there. Um, it's a long sleeved white shirt in stretch cotton, it was £18, which I think is a pretty good deal for a white shirt, you can spend upwards of like £50 for a really good shirt but you could also find some really awful ones that are super cheap. This seems like it's a good material, it's stretch cotton so it does have a bit of give but it's still quite structured, it doesn't seem too see-through as well which is another problem I find with white shirts and yeah it's apparently tailored so it fits and sits nicely around bigger boobs so let's stick this on and see how it looks. Okay, so I got this in a size 12 and I think it fits really nicely. You can see where it's tailored around the bust so it actually still fits around the rest of your body. It doesn't just hang from the bust area because that is one of the things that I hate about buying shirts is that normally you have to go a size bigger just so it fits around the girls but then it's massive everywhere else. So it's really nice to get a shirt that actually goes in and is properly tailored and doesn't gape. So there is an extra button that sits right there which you can do to your shirts as well. But as you can see the lines of the shirt do tailor around the bust area. I really like this. I was thinking at first maybe I could have got away with the 10, but I don't think so. I think it fits really, really nicely. And obviously the tall length is nice. My hips are about there, so that's where it sits on me um, at five foot six. The sleeves are a good length as well. I probably wouldn't ever wear them down, I don't think. I'd probably roll them up. The material feels really good, like it's not too heavy and it's not too light either. I like it, it's super comfortable. I'm gonna tuck it into my skirt and we'll see what it looks like. I am so happy with this. Finally, I have a white shirt that fits and it looks nice. It's not see-through, it's just beautiful. Look how well it fits. I'm amazed by this. I genuinely didn't think it was gonna be as good as it was for the price because like I said, 18 pounds I think is pretty reasonable for a good quality shirt. Fantastic for the office. Fantastic if you just team it and like team it down with some denim jeans or a denim skirt. Like it looks super casual but it's still quite smart. I love this, well done ASOS, this is making me excited to try it on the rest. So I also bought the sleeveless version because it's super hot in this country right now and I just love the look of sleeveless shirts so I'm going to try this one and see if it fits as well as this one. Okay, sleeveless shirt, it doesn't fit as well as the other one does 
um, which I'm confused about because it's exactly the same but just sleeveless. Um, it fits lovely around the bust which is obviously the point uh, but I feel like it's just a little bit baggy around the tummy area for me. I might have been able to get away with a size 10, maybe, I'm not sure. Uh, I got this in a 12 as well. But it's just really nice around the bust area. It doesn't gape around the armpit, which I find a lot of sleeveless shirts do when you've got a fuller bust. And it's also got the extra button in the middle as well. I like it. It's a really cute alternative for like a summer shirt. And if you don't mind getting your arms out, you know, it's not too bad. I teamed it with a little blue, powder blue skirt, which is super old from Primark, but there are so many of these fit and flare skirts around at the moment. You can find them everywhere. I think it looks nice with this top. I also think it balances me out a little bit because obviously the sleeve stop there, that skims over my hips at the widest point. So you can see kind of since you're doing it at the waist, but makes everything even. So it's quite a nice balancing outfit for say an hourglass figure. Um, but I like it, it just doesn't fit as well as the other one, but uh, maybe that's my fault, maybe I should have got a size down. It's nice though, the material is really good, it's not too see-through, well tailored, thumbs up from me. Now another style of top that is the bane of my big bus life is the cami top. I really love them with their little spaghetti straps but it's hard to find one that doesn't sort of like stretch across the bust area or if you have to go three sizes bigger just to fit the bust then it makes you look like a tent. So ASOS have got some in their range. They again are tailored for larger busts. You can see the darts at the side so they've been specifically designed to sort of take on a large breast. <laughs> So this was £18, so again it's not cheap for a cami top but it's going to be one of those staple pieces that you can put in your wardrobe and carry this all the way through the year. Uh, this was £16 by the way, so this is the same price as the original shirt. Let's pop this on and see how it fits. Okay, so ignore the fact that I've got a giant baggy trousers on. I'm going to tuck this in in a second, but I just wanted to show you what it looked like on its own. It's a nice length, actually. It's not short as I thought it was going to be. It kind of sits just at the top of your bum, and it fits a dream. Again, I got this in a size 12. It doesn't stretch around the boobs at all, but it also doesn't feel too big everywhere else. It actually has some shape to it. It doesn't make me look like a tent. I love the detailing across the bust. I think the v-neck's very flattering for a fuller bust figure, and it's just something a little bit different like it's so cute instead of just wearing a t-shirt all the time or having to stick to shirts you can rock the spaghetti straps with big boobs it works it's amazing I love it so I feel like this outfit is probably going to divide the audience again this is going to be rainbow trouser gate once more uh, but I actually really like it I think if you took it in it gives it some nice shape it just goes to show that you can wear a baggy top and baggy trousers together do not be afraid of trousers like this just tuck them in and you can see that you've still got that beautiful waist underneath but it's really cool it's a nice kind of like monochrome outfit if you don't want to rock bright colors you don't have to you can still look pretty cool in the black and white I'd probably rock this with a pair of flat form black trainers that I've got or maybe some black strappy sandals for a night out but I just think it's really cute you could pop some big earrings in uh like maybe some bright colored earrings to make it all pop but I love it I think this cami top's beautiful this is also from the tall range I've just realized as I tried to take it in saw the label uh so it makes it a really nice length if you are a little bit taller but you can also get this um not in the tall range as well I just like it it's I've got adjustable straps as well it's super flattering it's a basic black cami but it looks beautiful and the crisscross design gives it something a little bit special Okay, so the next one is uh, a white cami top. It's a little bit different to this. It's just a plain v-neck. Hasn't got the fancy strappy bits there. Um, you might have already seen this if you have watched my curvy summer look book. If you haven't already seen that, head over and watch after this. You'll enjoy. Uh, I'm going to quickly pop this on to show you what it looks like. It's beautiful. It's just a plain cami top. Again, looks a little bit short. I don't think this is a tall one. No, this is just from the normal range. So we'll see how that compares with the length of this one. It was only £12, which I think is a bargain. And it's got adjustable straps as well. So let's whack it on, see what it looks like. So this one feels a little bit bigger than the black one. It's just a different shape, really. Um, and it sits actually a little bit longer, even though that one was from the tall section. Um, it's a nice length. It's beautiful. You could wear it with jeans, for example. It kind of cuts off... Uh, my hips about there so that's where it cuts off on me um, it is quite baggy but it fits beautifully around the bust and with the v-neck it doesn't cut too low either and it's also got um, a good under armpit kind of curve if you you know what I mean if you've got big boobs it's always like super baggy there anyway um, I like it and with the adjustable straps you can make it sit as high or as low as you want so this skirt is from Primark um, I got it quite recently I think it was about £10 but I've just realised it's quite see-through and I'm wearing black boy shorts so if you can see my pants 
early birthday present for you, you enjoy. So, um, I really like how this looks when it's tucked into here. This is more of a pencil skirt, um, a midi length pencil skirt. It's really pretty, it's a little bit different to the A-line ones. Um, it's a bit tighter around the hips, so if you feel like you've got wider hips, maybe stick to the A-line skirt. But, I think it looks beautiful together, it's a really summery look. This looks wonderful tucked in, and I've just realised that it's actually double layered. So, it's a really good quality shirt, because this was only £12, and it's a double layered top. It's it's amazing, the quality is really good, it fits beautifully, I think it looks super pretty, easy to style with loads of different stuff, this would look good with those um, striped trousers, it would look good with that denim skirt, it would look good tucked in like a French tuck into a pair of denim uh, jeans, it just looks awesome, it's a really versatile top and one that should definitely be in your wardrobe if you have a fuller bust. And it also makes the girls look amazing, don't know why I'm doing this. So the last thing I sometimes struggle with is swimwear and bikinis because even if you do find some that do mix and match though where you can buy different sizes at the top and the bottom, I often end up finding that I have to buy like a size 20 or a size 22 to cover the boobs but then they're massive around the back and it's just an absolute nightmare then trying to find a smaller set of bottoms to go with it and even if you do find some that actually come in bra size, most of them don't go up past a double D which is ridiculous because big boob ladies need bikinis too. But never fear because ASOS have a fuller bust range of swimwear so it's everything from double D upwards and I picked up this beautiful, beautiful bikini from them uh, that is bra size and it's crochet so it's a halter neck one with a little tie thing here. I have already worn this, I'm not going to lie. Um, I was invited to a spa and I was feeling really miserable on the day and I was like, oh, I don't really want to get into a bikini. And then all this stuff arrived and I tried this on and it made me feel so amazing that genuinely it completely turned my day around. That's how good this bikini is. Um, and you can mix and match. So I got the bottoms in a size what size did I get? Size 12. And I actually got the top in a 34E because they didn't have an F and I took a risk and it actually works. So I'm going to put this on to show you how it fits and hope that I don't get thrown off YouTube. Um, I've put a picture of myself wearing this on my Instagram and we have such a lovely little family over on Instagram. So if you're not following yet, come and follow me. I'm at xmediax. There's a link down below. Um, and everyone was so lovely about it, but it just feels a little bit different doing it on video. So I'm going to pop this on so you can see how it fits and just hope that we stay body positive. Oh, let's get naked. I think it's really, really pretty. So the bottoms I got in a size 12, um, they have tie sides so you can make them as big or as small as you want them to be. I often find that I can feel quite big in bikinis if I get bottoms that are too small for me. So I always tend to go up a size. Now, normally I get a 14, but these are actually okay in a 12 because you can sort of loosen them up a little bit because then they don't dig in and stuff doesn't spill over and you just feel a little bit better. I don't know, maybe that's just me. The top is wonderful. It has underwiring underneath, so you've got a little bit of support, but there's no padding. Hallelujah! Because we don't need any padding. We've got fantastic boobs as it is, um, and it just feels really, really comfortable, feels nice and free. I think I probably could have done with the F, if I'm honest, but they didn't have it in stock and I just really liked it so I wanted it but the E fits okay the back size is perfect for a 34 um, it's it's just really really comfortable and this cute little bit down here also I don't know hides a little bit of the tummy if you're a little bit self-conscious about that area so they have so many different bikinis on there so definitely check them out they are pretty much true to size I would say and they're super super flattering for large busts so big thumbs up from me I bought a few from them before but thought I better treat myself to a new one for this haul so that is it for my ASOS Fuller Bust haul and review. It is so hot in here. I've lost all of my curls. I am sweating. But it was really good fun. I hope you enjoyed watching. Um, I really rate the range, if I'm honest. I think that they fit really well. They look amazing. And the price point's really good too. So I will leave a link down below if you want to go and check it out. Um, buy something from the range. Check it all down there. I'll pop a link to everything that I bought and also the range in general as well. So if they go out of stock, you can still find stuff. And also the Wonder Bra, I will leave a link for that as well. I think ASOS sell that too. So you can probably get it all in one go. Brilliant. And they do free delivery, which is amazing because that is one of my bugbears of online shopping. So leave me a comment down below and let me know which outfit you liked the best. And if there's anything else you would like to see curvy fashion related, I'm going to be popping together a curvy summer capsule wardrobe for you guys. So if you'd like to see that video, click that subscribe button. Make sure you stick around for that. That'll be coming for you in the next couple of weeks. But as always, thank you very much for watching and I'll see you again soon. Bye!
guy there and it just sort of helps close the gap if you do feel like it's getting a bit gapy but I'm pleased with this the size 14 fits really well a little bit big under there maybe but that does also help in the bust area and it was only 15 pounds so with a pair of six pound converse you've pretty much 